Hello and welcome to the Penguin Prof channel for educators. I'm Valerie Pennington and today I'm going to get you from paper to canvas using only your phone. Actually I can get you from whiteboard or window or sidewalk or anything really that you want to write on and get it into a digital format. All you're going to need is access to your MySWC account and the ability to download an app to your smartphone. And here are the steps that we're going to be going through. Don't worry, I'm going to show you everything. All right, here we go. So here we are at MySWC. Click on Campus Apps and then Service Now. Now I'm going to click on Institutional Technology. And then just select Work at Home Apps. And here I'm going to be able to click on the Adobe Creative Cloud and I'm going to have access to all the information about how to download the software that I want. There's desktop, mobile, definitely check these out. Adobe is incredible. But for the, our purposes, all you're going to want is to download from your app store the Adobe Scan app. And the first time you log in, it's going to ask you for your login information and make sure you use your Southwestern College credentials and then select the corporate or business account. And now you'll see the Southwestern College login screen. Once you log in, now you're going to have the main page here which will allow you to capture anything you want. It auto detects most things and here you can touch or have it automatically take the scan for you. And after you take the scan, you're going to have options to resize, retouch, recolor, all kinds of things. So here's the basic crop tool. And now here's my edit window. The first thing you want to do is give this a name. And of course, you can scan multiple pages, and they will be all together in a single PDF. I always include the date. That helps me find things, just in case I forget what I called them. Here's a really cool tool. Use two fingers to zoom and one finger to remove anything in the document that you don't want. So here, because this was from a worksheet, I don't want this distracting borderline, so I can just remove it. Now I can save it, email it to myself, save it to the phone, or get a link that I can send to other people. What about handwritten notes? Is it just that easy? Yeah, actually it is. So let's say I want to get this handwritten note into my canvas pages. So I go through the same steps. I capture the image. And I don't need to really remove anything here. I think it looks great. So again, I'm going to give it a distinctive name. And I always choose to include the date. And that's it. Now I've digitized my handwritten notes. And in this case, I sent it to myself. So this is what it looks like when I open it on my computer, but I want to get it into my Canvas page. So I highlight the link where I want the file to go, and I choose the file itself, which I've downloaded onto my computer. That's the PDF that we just scanned. Click Upload. And there it is. Once you click Save, now the PDF that we scanned can be accessed from this link. I can either download it, if I were a student, or preview it right here on the Canvas page. And as you can see, it looks perfect. If you want to see more videos like this, visit the EdTech playlist on the Penguin Prof channel, or visit on the web at edu.penguinprof.com. Good luck.